everyone. It's Seth. Um, I was listening to Core Killers this morning, and I thought I'd do a quick little video post about it. On Core Killers with Tom Merritt and Brian Brushwood, great show. Definitely support them over on Patreon.com. They t they are consistently talking about all these these new shows coming out on these different platforms. Now, when I think about it, uh, it's awesome that this stuff's coming out on these platforms and not on traditional cable. That's wonderful. But the problem is... Like, when they're not coming out on Netflix or Amazon or Hulu or something that can be on multiple boxes, instead they're coming out on Xbox or on a PlayStation 1 or any of those, you have to buy a console to watch these shows. It's not about, just about buying a service, it's about buying a console. I get that there's a draw for some of these shows, but would you go out and spend $400 on a console if you're not going to use it for something else? I don't know. Um, I wouldn't. I mean, that's the reason why I... Like, I there's this whole documentary, you know, coming out on Xbox. It sounds interesting. I'd love to watch it. I'm going to spend $400 to watch a documentary. And I own the Xbox One. So, I don't know. I'm not sure what I think about it. I think that if they release it on a platform or a console, and then they release it out to Netflix later or out on the cable later, I think it'd be a good thing, a good thing for this distribution. But I don't know how just setting it out on into the wild via a console, like Xbox One or PlayStation, um... I don't know. I don't know what I think. I don't know. What do you guys think? Let me know. Bye.